Hello citizens! In my experience, until now in most situations it was easier to go solo or bring multiple single seat ships, but in 3.14 that seems to be changing. Today I would like to talk about the benefits and reasons for multi-crew gameplay. As always, if you liked the video, sacrifice a like to the YouTube algorithm and subscribe for more or go check out my Twitch channel where I stream twice a week. Let me start off by saying that being a solo player is perfectly okay. The game has many loops that support solo gameplay and playing solo can sometimes be enjoyable. Also, by solo gameplay I mean that you play without other players or NPCs in your party. We haven't had any information on NPC crews in a while and I feel like NPC crews are a topic for a whole separate video. So first let's talk about the advantages of playing solo. I think the major ones is that you can play at your own pace and on your own schedule. Sometimes trying to organize groups can be a nightmare and I see why some people avoid it. Of course this comes with the major drawback that if you want to use a ship effectively your selection is very limited. Don't take me wrong, there are plenty of solo ships, but later in the game these won't be able to sustain you for long journeys. You have to keep in mind that most solo ships have small fuel tanks and no interior or bed for logging out. Of course there are some exceptions to some extent, like the Aurora, Avenger or the 100 and 300 series. Also many multi-seat ships like the Cutlass or the Vanguard can be useful even when not fully crewed. However you're going to have a very hard time trying to operate a large ship like the Carrack or the Hammer head on your own. So what available missions and activities can you do on your own? The list is actually pretty long. Deliveries, investigations and bounties are on the top of that list. You can also go mining but I usually recommend you either mine in very remote areas or that you bring someone else to protect you. You don't only need to defend yourself against players but on some occasions NPC ships will spawn and attack you as well. So now let's move on to the advantages of playing with other people. I think the clear advantage is that depending on the size of your party, you can crew every ship in the game effectively. The second advantage is that multiple people trying to solve a problem have a much higher chance of finding the solution. There have been countless of times when I encountered a bug or another problem and I was only able to figure it out with help from others. And finally, playing with others is just more fun. Not only you can do more things and check out more ships, I also feel that dealing with bugs and sometimes the game not working is just easier when you have someone to laugh about it with. On the other hand, while playing in a party you might encounter more bugs like desync or issues with the party launch. But I think that the issues are very small compared to the range of activities you can take part in. I really can't think of an activity that you can't do with multiple people. However, you should keep in mind that some missions are designed to be completed by one person. So the reward may not be high enough to bring a party of several people. Another note I have is that if you're playing in a party and you want to run voice comms, you should probably look into a separate platform like Discord or Gilded because the in-game VoIP is somewhat unreliable. Other than that, I feel that that the multi-crew experience has come a long way since I started playing Star Citizen and there's still more progress to be made and right now I think we're in the right place to make that happen in the coming months and years. Ultimately, whether you want to multi-crew or not is up to you, but I think you should give it a try at least once. Either find a random group in game or call up on some friends or if you want you can join me on stream every Tuesday and Thursday. With that being said, that's it for tonight. Why do you play solo? Why do you play with people? Is there anything you would change about the multi-crew experience? Let me know in the comments, fly safe and I will see you in the verse.